Hi, it's Nick Lagos here from Core Physio and Pilates Studios. So with footy season upon us, it's, we're getting lots of clients coming in asking us about their front knee pain. So today we thought we'd have a little bit of a chat about a patella tendon strap. It's this strap that we often use when people get patella tendonitis or that sort of front knee pain, at which this strap sometimes can help support the kneecap or also take that load and pressure off the patella tendon. So this strap, it comes as a sort of circular band doesn't really come apart, but it actually has a really um, a jelly sort of buttress inside it, which is what puts pressure against the patella tendon. And it has these straps on the sides, which we use to adjust the pressure of that so that you can put more or less pressure on and make it comfortable. Often when people start using this strap, we recommend that they put it on quite lightly, pretty gentle so that it's comfortable and doesn't put too much pressure. But as you get used to it, you can increase that pressure, which takes a load off your patella tendon. So let's have a little look at how this works. So we're going to place the patella strap over the foot. Obviously, because it's a continuous ring, we need to kind of squeeze it over and put it on. So you do want it to be firm, but you don't want it too tight. Obviously, if you size it wrong, you won't be able to get it all the way on. So we bring the strap until it's underneath the kneecap. So we can see here's Michael's kneecap, and here's the sort of bumpy bit on the shin bone. And we're actually putting the strap directly in between the bottom of the kneecap and that bumpy bit. So it's sitting right on top of the patella tendon. Um, you want that jelly buttress to be right in the middle there on top of the tendon. So that's what's really applying the pressure on the tendon, which is then causing the positive effects of the knee brace. The effects that we're hoping to get are obviously that take the pressure off this area here where the patella tendon attaches and also change the mechanics of the kneecap. So it's going to work really differently now that patella tendon strap is on and unload the kneecap. We can change the pressure by adjusting it and the adjustment comes from these two straps on the side which is a great feature of the brace. And to start off, you want to pull on pretty lightly and not put too much pressure. If your um, patella tendon is inflamed or if it's quite irritable, then you want to start off with a light pressure and then increase it as you get more comfortable or you get more used to the brace. You want to make sure also that when you um, put the brace on, there's no bits digging into the skin at the back. So we often recommend to our clients just to kind of trim these edges here, trying to make it more comfortable so none of this is sort of digging into the back of the knee. With young kids, this is really important because getting them to actually use the brace, the compliance, is what it's all about. Obviously, if you've bought a brace for a young kid to help them with knee pain and they're not going to wear it, then obviously it's been a waste of money. To take it off, obviously you undo the straps just to sort of take that pressure off and then you just need to sort of pull it down to wiggle it off. So this, that's the patella tendon strap. It's an excellent brace for knee pain, for certain types of knee pain. I really do recommend though that you do head into a clinic, either a core physio practice or your local physio to get it properly fitted and also to get maybe some other strategies that you can use to help your knee pain. Um, things like exercises, icing, that kind of stuff might be really crucial component to using the knee brace. Um, thanks very much for watching our video. You can go to our YouTube channel to find out other videos and interesting things about um, physical problems and braces. Um, we'll see you in the clinic.